this year the uh, opera that Summerscape will produce is an opera called Demon, The Demon by Anton Rubinstein. It is a fantastically beautiful piece. It has a serious reputation largely because uh, Anton Rubinstein, the composer, was next to Tchaikovsky, the most famous Russian composer and musician of the 19th century, not only in Russia, but throughout Europe and America. It was uh, written in 1870, I think it was premiered in 1871, and it's based on a poem by the Russian writer Mikhail Lermontov. This demon story, which he wrote, which is a kind of fantastic story, it's a kind of allegorical story, if you will, was um, considered so racy that it was banned, actually, until 1860. And uh, it became the most popularly read historical poem, if you will, uh, in, in, in Russian literature. So it's the main character is an obsessive Mephistophelian character that's often like the devil or the agent of the devil, the supernatural powers. And so there's kind of fantasy supernatural aspect to this. And uh, the princess is a, uh, Tamara is a uh, kind of innocent, idealized female figure. And the opera is more similar, I think, uh, for listeners to Tchaikovsky, although there is a moment uh, in the opera surrounding the musical description of the princess that will sound very Russian or oriental, if you will, you know, exotic, the way we identify with Mussorgsky or Rimsky-Korsakov or Balakirev or any of the so-called Mighty Handful, the Mighty Five. And it'll be directed by Thaddeus Strasberger. And we have a fantastic cast. And the story is absolutely a classic, you know, fantasy story. This is a romantic story which does actually probe the sense that desire is evil and that seduction is a form of a manipulation and fraud and destruction. It what makes the story so riveting because it's not about a demon, it's not about extraterrestrial beings, it's about ourselves. And this is a great literary and musical uh, evocation of, of the human sentiments that are involved in this set of myths and ideas.